Being president is about making tough choices. The next president will have many difficult decisions to make. Biden has many decisions to make now, many tough choices. How do we end this terrible war in Gaza while still ensuring security for the state of Israel? How do we address the issue of climate change without disrupting our economy too much? How do we stop Putin's aggression in Ukraine without dragging the United States into what could become World War III? A similar question could be raised about Taiwan. How do we reform and expand our democracy? These are all difficult questions. We can list many more that are difficult choices. And I think President Biden is wrestling with them. I'm not saying he's doing it perfectly. But if you want to understand the difference between the candidates, the difficult question with which Donald Trump seems to be wrestling this week is that if he is on some kind of a giant boat with a powerful battery and his boat is sinking and he's in danger of being electrocuted, is it better to be electrocuted or to be eaten by the shark that is 10 yards away? I'm not making this up. Donald Trump spent time talking about this at a recent event because that shows you the deterioration that is going on with regards to his mental facilities and how wildly, wildly unqualified he is to be president. Even if he weren't a fascist and a criminal, he would still be mentally incapable of doing this job. And the fact that Joe Biden is old doesn't change that and doesn't change the reality that Biden is competent enough to do this job and Donald Trump has completely unraveled.